Hey guys, uh, welcome to another Photoshop tutorial here on psdvault.com YouTube channel. Uh, this is just a, a quick tutorial to show you how I basically apply some uh, color effects on this photo manipulation work. Um, so yeah, this is the um, uh, one of the tutorial I have on psdvault.com and uh, just basically uh, just to show you the last step where we um, get to um, adding some colors to this uh, basically just a black and white and with some red color image um, so the way I do it is just uh, just to use um, a bunch of uh, image adjust image adjustment layers um, as you can see I've got a, a selective color layers uh, adjustment layer here and also a color balance adjustment layer um, plus a curves uh, adjustment layer so the the reason why I use the selective color adjustment layer here is because uh, basically we've got a, a, a pretty simple image here uh, just basically we've got the white color uh, some white colors here and the black background and some red colors on, on the lips so with the selective color adjustment layer we can uh, basically adjust um, the um, the channels so basically we've got the um, the red um, the red colors here um, if you if if you basically just um, adjust the uh, colors here you will see uh, only the the red color on the image that will change um, all the other colors uh, remain unchanged so yeah so this uh, this makes uh, the adjustment a bit easier um, and also uh, we can adjust the the white uh, colors here so as you can see if you slide the um, the, the, the values here uh, only the white parts uh, of the image um, is uh, affected um, all the rest of the colors won't, won't change so uh, yeah so that makes it easier to um, to add colors to a um, to a black and white image here um, so yeah and also for the black colors here uh, if you adjust that you can basically change the background color uh, because on the background there's only um, um, pretty much just black colors there so yeah so that's you can easily just adjust the background color um, just by sliding the um, these uh, measurements here um, yeah so on top on top of that one um, I also there's some layer masks um, being applied here as well because I, I don't want the whole image uh, to have color so just wanted to have some areas of the image that's uh, got some coloring effect um, so yeah so on top of that selective color layer I also added a color balance adjustment layer so this is pretty straightforward just to uh, add some more variety um, to the image um, so um, with the color balance adjustment layer um, basically it's just just a matter of um, yeah just the, the mid tones and the shadows uh, yeah so and uh, yeah and the highlights um, yeah just a, a bit of slight adjustment here and so as you can see I own I also have a, a mask applied on the color balance adjustment adjustment layer yeah so this is just to um, to uh, hide uh, some parts of the of the layer so um, yeah not the whole image gets adjusted just there's just some parts of the image that for example in this case is the left hand side of the face uh, we'll have some colors here and yeah so on top of that uh, color balance adjustment layer I also added a curves adjustment layer so with the curve adjustment layer you can change um, basically change um, the channel uh, here so if you click on that drop down box you can change select the red color red channel um, you can adjust the the amount of uh, red uh, on the image just by um, 
changing the input and output value of the image. Uh, yeah, you can also adjust the green here. So yeah, so that will basically add some more color effects on the image as well. Um, yeah, and you can adjust the overall RGB uh, value as input and output as well, just to give the, a bit more contrast to the image. Yeah, so um, that's basically how you um, how you can add some color effects uh, to a uh, just a, a black and white image. Um, in this case, uh, we use the selective color adjustment layer, the color, the color balance adjustment adjustment layer, and the curves uh, adjustment layer. Um, yeah, but uh, yeah, so it all depends on what sort of work that you use. Uh, so in this case, um, we've got a, a pretty simple uh, image he image here. So yeah, so we'll only use uh, some simple adjustment layers uh, with some uh, basic uh, layer mask here. Um, but if you got a, a bit more complicated work, um, there's usually uh, much more work um, than just this one. But uh, hopefully, uh, by uh, by doing by by showing you this, uh, will give you some idea of uh, how to apply color effect uh, onto the image. Um, yeah, and there's uh, there's uh, yeah, of course, there's uh, going to be more more work uh, down on uh, on a more complicated project. Yeah, so uh, that's it for this tutorial. Um, hope you in hope you um, find it useful, and uh, we'll see you next time.